All right, playing some Ace 3 VR today. Uh, I'm not going to do any taking holds or anything like that. Uh, what I did today, though, was uh, I finally bit the bullet, so to speak, and uh, opened up my controller, which was having the uh, trackpad problem, like I keep complaining about. Well, I took a Torx, uh, I opened it up, made sure I didn't uh, break it or anything, but uh, I finally fixed that trackpad, so... Um, well, let me just check out the, uh, da -da 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 -da. this is me pressing, uh, right. It was right on the trackpad. It was really gummy and sticky and, and just, you know, see, now everything works properly. Oh, but I don't want to mess it up, so let's not do that anymore. But yeah, it seems like, uh, there's a common problem with the, uh, Vive controllers is that, uh, over time, the, uh, little rubber pad, uh, underneath the trackpad gets, uh, shifted and, uh, yeah, mine was, like, if you imagine the center of, like, this circle right here, the, uh, the rubber was, like, right up here, if you can see that. It was in center. It was, like, right there. So I had to, I had to take a little tiny flathead screwdriver and, like, pry the little rubber up and, uh, put it back center. But now I can finally use bolt actions without any problems. Come on, there we go. Oops. Ah, that's what I hate about this, though, uh, when I'm using bolt actions. Oh, no. Still need to uh, practice with them, but uh, they seem to be... Uh, my, my trackpad seems to work properly now. Oops. And it is wonderful. Sorry to steal that from Anton, but it really, it really is wonderful. You know, just like usually, I have, I'd have so many problems with the bolt actions, especially with the quick bolting. But uh, now with the uh, fixed trackpad. Oops, I missed. So, yeah. Uh, I mean, I'm just really, I'm just really uh, happy. Because that, like, that's a scary process, right? The, these controllers are like, what, $200 each? So if I manage to break one by just messing around with it, uh, that's terrible. Let's, uh, let's play with more bolt actions. Oh, I love that. Now that that, that, uh, that uh, trackpad works really nicely. Oh, oops, safety's on. Oh, I'm out. I should really get a sight. And you know what? Since uh, the update dropped last Friday, or this Friday, well, last Friday, Anton decided to fix a couple bugs and uh, some of the uh, weapons that weren't in there in the uh, item spawner. I think it was, uh, yeah, the AUG A1. Also, I think some of the, uh, some of the AKs had new magazines, right? Which I want to check out. Well, I need to find an AK. Oh, that's not the, that's the Klishna Luger. Uh, assault rifle? AKM tactical? Oh, these two right here. So this is the uh, 10 round, and this is the 20 round, so I'll play with those. Oop, I had to pop my jaw there. <laughs> Hope you didn't hear that. Uh, but uh, let me see. Oh, uh, one of the new attachments that uh, was not uh, in the item spawner yet was the sustenance reflex. Basically, the uh, the uh, reflex site that was, that's, fine, uh, that's found in the uh, MP7, right? That's in the game now. Oh, properly. Yeah, well, it's been in the game. It's just never, not in the item spawner, so. Take that off. That's uh, not a good idea on a bolt action. Let's try a scope. Let's go with a, um, hmm, 3 by 12 Stick this on there. Stick this on, and then, oh, so good. I love it. 
basically this is how you this is how you work uh bolt actions in this game before it would be like uh, I, I i can't get the thing to work but now Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh, it's so good to get that trackpad finally working properly. Oh, let's try another weapon here. Let's try another bolt action. Oh, it's so nice to get that working. That is so good. I don't know if you can hear it. Before, it wouldn't, it wouldn't even click. You know, because it was so gummed up. Due to that uh, rubber pad but let's uh try another bolt action i can finally enjoy bolt action let's try the uh the uh, delisle carbine that's 45 acp Ooh. Oop, oh, safety did i get that one no i didn't there we go. So now all I have to worry about is uh, hitting myself in the face, doing the quick bolting. Oh, you know what? Where's the extended mag for this? I <laughs> uh, remember that from the uh, machine pistol, the Dillinger. There we go. Let's get this baby on here. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Hold on. Oh, nope. There is no drop. Oh, yeah, it's a little bugged out there, but I mean, this is a extended magazine. I don't know if you. Oop. Sometimes I do it a little too fast. Oh, come on. We still have ammu ammunition in this thing? Yeah. All right, let's try something a little louder, a little more fun. Let's uh, get rid of all these uh, empty magazines. <laughs> uh, I just want to play around with all these bolt actions now that I've uh, fixed uh, all the issues. Oh, the French FR2, FRF2. Get this baby on there. Oh, let me uh, spawn lock the mag here. I guess this video is just going to be all about bolt actions today. Get this uh, bipod. Oh, you know what? I need a... Uh... Are you going to float? Yes, you are. Get this uh, over here. And adjust the... Uh... Let's try a longer target here. Uh, uh, farther target, longer, <laughs> longer target. No, that's a little too high. I don't know if I can do a bolt action on this thing. You know what? Ah, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna freehand it. I'm not gonna use the, the bipod. Okay, and that one in there. Oh, where is the target? Oh god, I missed. Ah, oh, keep missing. There we go. Go for the uh other target here. Oh, I got it. Oh, it's hard. I think I'm out. What else is there? Uh the car 98k? I'm just gonna put this uh, this new trackpad, or well, this this fixed trackpad to its paces. Dump that. Get that over there. Oh, too fast sometimes. You gotta do it nice and smooth. Oh, look at that. That is so good. 
That trackpad is nice and good. Oh, a little too fast there. I'm gonna nice rhythm. Like that. Let me try uh see if the other controller needs work. Yeah, that's no the, the other controller is pretty good. It was just the one controller that I uh, had problems with. But yeah. I'm just gonna keep shooting some bolt actions today. Cool. Out of uh, ammo for that one. That's pretty good. Uh, the jungle carbine. Ooh. Get the magazine as well. Oh, you can use stripper clips, but uh, let's put a magazine in there. Oh, too fast. Oops. Sometimes I literally uh, am quick bolting this thing too fast. Like, uh, I missed a couple there because, again, hmm. bad, not bad. Let's see. A scout. A little uh, counter strike on there. <laughs> this one has iron sights as well, so. Right here and right here. And it also has, um,. It's a bipod, <laughs> if you didn't know that. But, uh, wait, hold on. Did I spawn a magazine for the scout? That's not the magazine. This is the magazine right here. Shoot the uh, red target over there. Safety off. Oh, it is so good. Can we still not put the magazine in the uh, rear? Nope, we can't. Anton uh, still needs to figure that out. But uh, yeah, this uh, this trackpad fix, I love it. <laughs> I'm so glad I did it because now it's uh, it's a lot better. I can tell you that. Oh, and uh, I think uh, last time in Taken Hold, I kind of complained about the uh, the Chaytac with uh, quick bolting. There is no quick bolting for this. <laughs> I just remembered. So you have to manually uh, chamber around every time. So that was a mistake on my part. That's empty. So yeah, <laughs> I was complaining about that and taking hold. Like I can't, I can't quick bolt this thing. But no, there's no quick bolting. I really love that though. I fixed my trackpad. It is so good. This. Oh yeah, this is the site. I like that. All right, what else can I do? Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, you know what? I've been always trying to figure out if I could actually. Uh, there was, there was, if I remember correctly, there was a way to uh, decock revolvers, but I could never figure it out. So I'm going to try to figure that out now. Let's uh, add this. So that pulls it back. So basically, hold on. Oops. Yeah. Oh no.
<laughs> nope, that's not the way to do it. I still, I don't, um, yeah. I don't, re I don't really uh, know if you can decock a revolver. But, uh. Oh, God. Oh, goodness. But, yeah, you know, whatever. That's not really uh, an important thing in my, uh... I love the R8. The only left-handed revolver in the game. Pretty cool. <laughs> There's not much else to do. I don't know why I started recording this, but uh, I was gonna do some shooting. I guess I'm, I am doing some shooting. Oh, actually, you know what? Let me try these bolt action pistols. Oh yeah, I got rid of the uh, infield. Yeah, my only problem now is uh, like cutting the uh, the action short. So I usually what I do is I go this way and then like halfway, and I don't load it properly. Ah, oh, there we go. Ah, oh, man. Can't do that, huh? <laughs> the bolt is too far away from the other hand, so. Ah, missed. <laughs> oh, it's so nice having a fixed trackpad. Oh, what else can we do here? Uh, I'm gonna mess around with some of the. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. The. Um, let's go with the assault rifle here. Got the AK-74 with its, uh, oh, we've got the drum magazine. All these different magazines. This is a 20-rounder. It's a 10-rounder, and there's a drum. The standard magazine for the AK. The new ones are the uh, these uh, this 20-rounder and then this 10-rounder. Uh, Those are the new ones. Oh, come on. <laughs> no, I wanted to make that reload look smooth, you know? One more. Oh, come on. Oh, that would have been a good, good smooth reload. One more. <laughs> I don't do it that well. I don't, I don't really know how to do the uh, tactical... AK reload. Get in the magazine. There we go. Or 
course, you can adjust the sights. Though I've never really... Uh, And then you get the uh, 20 rounder. A lot more easier with a 20 rounder. All right, let's get the uh, 10 round. Let's see if we can do the tactical reload with this. Tiny, tiny magazine. Yeah. Alright, let's, let's do the drum mag. See if we can do that. Oh, hey, it fits in that slot. That's nice. Guess you can't do that with that, huh? Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Let me just, uh... Oh, maybe I am doing it wrong. Just a fat magazine, that's what it is. stuff what else was there uh akm with its tactical magazines we do have a drum mag for this a5c a101 I'm not really too familiar with the whole AK platform, so you're going to have to excuse me. In a minute. Oh, you can change it to zero distance. That's nice. Standard AK mag. AKM. The drum mag, which I think can fit in these pouches. No? Cannot? Really? Huh. Okay. Well, I mean, understandable. Because this is a bigger... Bigger round. It's uh, 7.62 by 39. So, start off with the drum mag here. Oops. Get in there. There we go. Oh, did I not chamber uh, <laughs> around? Okay, pretty cool. Oh, trackpad is fixed. Makes it so much easier to uh, spawn lock things. Cam tactical, same thing. Uh, what other uh, AK style magazines we got in here? I should have looked at the um, the patch notes. Okay, let's see. Carbine. Wait, hold on. Oh yeah, we could use the uh, 
the uh, small AK-74 magazines. The AKS-74U. Look at this tiny gun. Tiny boy. Pull the stock. I can't pull the stock. There we go. Pull the stock that way. No, oh, hold on. You get a bigger mag. Oh, wait. Did I not spawn any other magazines? Okay. <laughs> Just taking a look at that. All right, what else is there? Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, the tactical. Okay. Nice. Hmm. Here's the sustenance MP7. On? Okay, there we go. I was like, I was waiting for it to spawn, huh? I don't know what's going on there. Sometimes you just gotta take a couple of days to practice, you know? Practice your shooting. Practice your reloading. Like brush up on your skills. Oh, uh, wait, hold on. Is there a grenade? Oh, well, you know what? I'll just spawn it from the underbarrel. There we go. Oh, well, what else can I shoot? Uh, pretty bored today, that's why I'm playing AC VR. And you had nothing else to do. Let's play some uh, AC VR. <laughs> uh, let's see, what can we uh, play around with here? Actually, you know what? Oh, well, you know, I, I was just thinking of uh, resuming my customization. I don't know how many weapons I have now. Whoa, not a loading there. Okay, I did revolvers. Did I do all the revolvers? Oh, okay. No, that's a submachine gun. Wait, hold on. What is this? SP5KA3. That's weird. That should be in the pistol section, right? I'm pretty sure that's a pistol. Uh, huh. That is strange. So I think I did all the revolvers, so I'm not too sure. Now I think, uh, I'm into machine pistols. 
but that just takes a whole lot of time. I spend literally like hours just customizing all the guns. Well, trying to at least. So now I gotta do all these. Oh, hold on, wait a minute. Okay, no, okay, yeah, yeah, that was, that was a machine pistol, okay. No, wait, that didn't say machine pistol, though. That's the MP58, that's a submachine gun. SP5KA3. Yeah, see, this is the uh, pistol. That should be a pistol, but uh, I don't know why that's a uh, saving over there. Has a what, what icon is that? Is that a carbine? Well, that's the carbine icon, right? Yeah, that's the carbine icon. <laughs> I don't know if it like automatically detected that it was a carbine. Yeah, the SP5 KA3. That's a pistol. That's a pistol. This is a submachine gun. I know that. This is the Half-Life gun that I made. Which, oh yeah, I still gotta, I still gotta upload this, huh? Oh, I completely forgot about that. Ah, uh, well, you know, it's not that hard to make. So. Oh wait, this doesn't have the, oh uh, yeah. Yeah, so this is a pistol. I don't know what this is doing with the uh, carbine icon, but... So yeah, I got machine pistols. Oh, the M9 Cleric. I haven't played this uh, played with this in a long time. Oh my goodness, look at all these mags. <laughs> this is what happens when you play this game. You just like, suddenly everything is, everything is filled up. Uh, at least Anton gave us an uh, option to clean up this stuff. This one I need to throw away. Oh, that's good enough. You know what? Let's get a double. Let's get some doubles in here. All right, lock that. Lock that slide open. <laughs> the gun kata. Ooh, yeah. I like, uh, you know what, I like Equilibrium as much as anybody else, but uh, that, those action scenes were pretty, well, you know, I, I'm I, I'm more personally into, like, realistic kind of, like, action scenes, but, uh, oh, well, I mean, look, I like Equilibrium, all right, just as much as anyone. I even have the DVD, but that was when I was, like, a kid, so... You know, I mean, I, well, I still like it. It's it's not bad. Well, it's not bad, but uh, it didn't really work out so well in the box office. I remember seeing it in theaters when it came out, and uh, not everybody went to see it. So <laughs> I'm sorry about that, but the movie was a terrible flop in theaters. I was like, me and a couple of other friends of mine in high school like went out to see it, and that was about it. So... It's, uh, it's an okay movie, honestly. But uh, uh, let's just not sugarcoat it. It was a terrible flop. And it only became like a cult classic when it was released on uh, home video or DVD. So. Yeah. Terrible accuracy. <laughs> Gun kata. It was like, oh, what was it again? It was like back behind the back, and then forward like this. Yeah, something like that. 
Oh, <laughs> well, you know, those are that's a pretty cool gun, to be honest. Let's see, what else is there? Uh machine pistols, breech loading. The rash oh the volcanic. The volcanic. One of the most terrible weapons. How many is this? Seven? Eight? Hold on. One, two, oops. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Whatever. No, oh, it is eight. Okay. I will destroy this pot. There we go. Sometimes the uh, shots kind of glance off the pot there. I, I saw it. You saw it. it. It moved after I shot it. There we go. Some of these bigger pots a little stronger. Oh, I missed that one completely. Hold on. Okay. Am I out? Oh, wow. I'm out. Oh, man. I will hit this thing. There we go. Oh, my. There we go. Ah, whatever. It's the volcanic. <laughs> it looks fancy. But apart from that, that's all it really is. Uh, let's see. Muzzle loading. Derringer. And we already played around with the Derringers before. You know, I never really play around with the uh, shotguns that much. I mean, maybe I did, but not that much anymore. Terminator 2 variant. This one is like six, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it's six shots. Plus one in the chain. No, wait, yeah. It's five plus one. Three, four, five. Pretty cool. Uh, let's see. Uh, what else? Oh. You check out this boss 12. It's been a while since I uh, played with this. <laughs> Still need to work on them gravity gloves. Oh, yeah. I remember Anton said he fixed the stock, so it should be good now. I just want to take a look at this model. Things are a little bit shaky, huh? Alright, so... Okay, put it into pump action mode. Trying to remember how this all works. It's, uh, it's been a while since I used it. There we go. Okay, I think it's uh, thumb down on the uh, touchpad to unlock the uh, pump mode. Hmm. 
And then you uh, press down again to uh, put it into uh, semi-automatic. There's a button here. There's a button there. But uh, yeah, let me just... Uh, Oh yeah, that's how you go. So um, on this hand, on your dominant hand, if you got like this, hold on. I'm trying to re trying to refresh myself with the uh, mechanics of this game. So if you uh, if you've got the uh, if you've uh, what you call it if you pumped it already, and it's locked, another way to open it without having to pull the trigger because usually you'd pull the trigger right. But another way to open the uh, the chamber again is to press up on the touchpad on this hand. See? Oh, hold on. Oh well, I didn't chamber it properly, so uh, I can't. I can't. I'm moving this hand right. I can't pump it back. Well, one way to uh, open that up again is to press up on the touchpad. Like oh, uh, I want to. I want to cycle to the next round without firing it. What do I do? I press up on the touchpad. It's like, see, it's locked in now. You can't, you can't, you move this, you can move this hand all you want. The only way to do it is to pull the trigger. But you don't want to do that, right? Because that's not safe. You got to be, you got to be safe. So should be a button or something. Uh, on real shotguns, there should be a button. I don't know. I don't know what it's called, but uh, let's see. Uh, hmm. No, I don't know. I'm not really too familiar with shotguns. They're not really my my specialty, but. Uh, Come on, ready? Hold on. I'm trying to get the uh, gravity gloves to work here. Oh no! No, get over here. All right, that's stuck. <laughs> oh yeah, the gravity gloves. Completely forgot. Oops! Grab the uh, stock there. Give me, give me this. Hold on, just a second. Let me uh, load this up. I dropped it. Oh, come on. That was perfect. All right, let's uh let's move on to something else. All right. Uh oh yeah, the uh Shrogren. I don't know how you pronounce that. Sorry for all you uh I don't know where this is actually from. I forgot. <laughs> it's been a while. The inertial. I've already, I've already played around with that one a lot. Four. Break actions. Oh yeah, the four-letter word. It's uh Oh. 
Nope, that's not what I wanted. Oh, oh no, <laughs> I threw it too far. Huh. You're not getting that? Oh, whatever. That's fine. <laughs> I need to practice my uh, gravity gloves. Oh yeah, I fired those. No, that's not what I wanted. Let's switch it back to uh, individual barrels now. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know why that's not working. Come on. I look into the model. Someone needs to, uh, someone needs to, uh, put that back in its place. is there to mess around with I'm gonna I haven't used in a while you know I could never actually understand this weapon right here it's a magazine fed shotgun well you know that's not my that, that's not the thing that really confuses me this is a magazine fed shotgun but can you put like individual rounds in the uh in the tube? I don't think so, right? I thought you could. Oh, you probably can't because it's ma- Oh, that's right. Ah, I'm so stupid. Yeah, since uh, since this one comes with a magazine, I don't- Because the way the game works, I guess, this one doesn't have a magazine. Because if you think about it, this is the magazine of the gun, of the uh, of the shotgun, right? So this is the magazine, it's got a tube magazine. But since this one comes with a like a regular magazine, because I think there's like a limitation on like. Like, a gun can't have, like, two different magazines, right? That's why we can't have, like, underbarrel uh, master key. Because that one's, like, a shotgun mounted, right? But it's got a tube magazine. I don't know. You know? I don't really know. All I know is that this gun has a magazine, and you can't... You can't put uh, shells inside of the tube there. So... This one is a uh, slam fire, if I remember correctly. Oops. But, yep. Pretty cool. Uh, let's see, what else? Uh, oh, man. Uh, rifles. Hmm. Oh, the G11. You know what? Let's play around with that. I don't use it that much. Might as well get some time with it. Alright, we need to do this. Okay, and then we switch over to three-round burst. Or not three-round burst. That's like the 
the burst mode, which is pretty fast. Oh, yeah, that's right. Do that. Trying to do this like the right handed way. Basically, no, I don't know. Oh, wait, I'm I don't know why I'm doing that. I can just change the uh, the fire selector to uh, burst with the uh, trackpad. I'm trying to do it physically by going to the uh. I really never looked at the model properly, but, uh, oh yeah, it's a pretty unique looking weapon. Look at that. German space gat. Aceless ammunition. That's a crazy concept. I'll basically reload it like this. Wind it up like a, you know, a wind up toy. I should use both hands. One more for the one more for the road. Well, I'm not done yet. Maybe I am. I don't know. Come on, get in the get in the slot. Let's see if I let's see how fast I can fire this thing. Whoop. <laughs> Whoop. Yeah, larger guns when you throw them, they kind of have a slower kind of uh arc so you can grab them with the gravity gloves better like the spas 12 you know all right what else can i uh mess around with here oh the g36 i haven't really used this one that much huh not entirely my like my favorite gun but it's still pretty cool pretty cool looking Freaking gun. Too bad they don't have the clear magazines, but that's a technical limitation. You know, because you can't, uh, the bullet, the magazines don't show all the bullets. Those just, like, a simple representation of bullets, but, uh, oh, you could, uh, yeah, you can't also clip magazines to each other. Which is, uh, too bad, but you know what? That's fine. Hmm. Oh, out. I don't know what the point of this uh, recording is. <laughs> I'm just shooting guns, you know? I should be playing like Taken Hold or something, but... Uh, I'm just so happy that uh, my, my repairs for the, uh, the trackpad worked. I didn't break anything. I have like these like fat fingers that usually like when you're trying to like when I'm trying to open the 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 the, the shell right. I was like, oh man, I'm probably gonna break these things. <laughs> no, I didn't. So that's good. Let's see what else. 
What else? Just uh, shooting guns today. No taking hold, I guess. I don't know how long this video's been going. I want to check. I can't really see that close, though, so... I don't know. Ooh. Spectre. How did I play around with that? Golden eye gun. Oh man, I, I can't remember. What was that? Was it the Phantom? Oh man, it's been a while since I played Goldeneye. Yeah, I think it was the Phantom, right? I kind of wish it had the stock, you know? There's a version out there with the stock, but uh, I guess Anton got this one without the stock. Oh, nope, I wanted uh, another one. I really like the look of this, though. Also, that, that quad stack magazine. You got four stacks right there. Like 40 rounds, uh, I think. Not too sure. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I'll drop those right there. there those. What else? Huh. Oh, the PPSH Modern. Can't put that there. Got the blue uh, muzzle flash. Wait, was it blue? I thought it was blue. Is it blue? I can't really tell. It's too bright out here. I think it used to be blue, right? I don't know if it's been changed, but... Uh... Let's do one more. Oop. Oh. Yeah, I really need to get rid of that thing. Oh, did I not get all the magazines? There we go. Ooh. The UMP, that, that one I haven't used in a long time. Two round burst. All right, hold on. Yep. There we go. <laughs> the UMP-45. Oh, man. Uh, let's see. What else? P90 I haven't used in a while. One of the more interesting looking weapons. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's kind of weird how it sits in the quick bolt like that, but... Uh... Oh wait, this doesn't have any sights. Oh man. Get in there. Get in there. 
Yeah, I'm not really much of a fan of using it. I do like the gun. But, uh... Just loading it in this game is a little tough. There we go. But it was my favorite for a long time. Yeah. Still okay. It's an okay gun. But my 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 actual favorite is the MP7, so. <laughs> yeah. Between the two, uh, I think I gravitated more towards the MP7. Most likely because it's probably in uh, Half-Life. <laughs> Half-Life 2. Which we see with the sustenance. Put these sights up right here. But yeah, we've already fired that one. I don't know why I'm firing that one again. Mostly, mostly because it was a sustenance. Alright, what else? Uh, battle rifles. What haven't I uh, used in a while? Oh, we got the, uh, yeah. Scar CQC, that was pretty new. The bolt actions. Hmm. I've already played around with those. Go to the ordinance here. See what we can use. Ah, the China Lake. Been a while since I used this. Meat miss, right? One, two, three, four. Yeah, it's four rounds. <laughs> that is pretty cool. Boom. No explosion? Hmm, that's weird. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I was waiting for that. Okay. This is terrible. I think. Can't really tell what the markings are. 100 meters? I think that's 100 meters. I missed. That's not 100 meters. That might be 100 meters over there. No more? Okay. Alright, well, <laughs> I was waiting for it. Alright, what have I not used in a while? Stinger missile? Well, I would use the stinger, but uh, there's nothing to shoot at over here. Hmm. Some of these grenade launchers, well, you know, we, really, we don't really need to fire the grenade launcher. What about, what about a machine gun? It's a... Uh, Get a little bit of MG42 here. Check out the uh, belt box again. This will probably be the last one. Ooh. 
Ooh, man. That was a lot of slowdown. Let's get two of them. <laughs> oh, man. I can hear my computer just burning up. Okay, what else we got here? Let's see. You know what? Let's end with a classic minigun. Because I haven't used this one in a while. Okay, there we go. Although, I still love the fact that you can, like, hold the trigger halfway and keep the barrel spinning. That is a really cool mechanic. Just, uh, you know, just warm it up, you know, just warming it up. You know? Getting it ready. Oh wait, does this thing have rails? I've always wanted to check. I don't think so. Yeah, it's been, a, it's been, like I said, it's been a while since I shot this, uh... Look at that, red hot barrels. Wait, wait, let me try to gravity glove this. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, bigger guns are so much easier to gravity glove. Oops. Just try it with the uh, MG42 here. Oh, nope. That was spinning too fast. All right, so I think that should be it for today. Uh, I don't know. I was just uh, testing out my controllers because, uh, like I said, I opened them up to uh, fix the track pads, and uh, obviously that worked. But uh, uh, can we do? I was uh, I was thinking of uh, showing off those those uh, track pad fixes or track track pad fix. But I think we've had enough. Maybe go out with the... Uh, let's see. I don't know what to choose. These are all really good. Yeah, let's do the... Uh, Arcano. Oh, come on. I thought I was done. I still want to keep playing for some reason. Nope, just the uh, one. Oops. Whoa. Forgot safety was on. There we go. Oh. So good. Trackpad is nice and good. No more problems with it for now. I mean, it's probably one one of these days. It's probably gonna go bad again, but I know how to fix it. So yeah, yeah, that should be about it for today. Whoops, too many guns. Clean this up. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.